So first up, Starbucks let customers trace their coffee's provenance from bean to brew. When I first saw this, I'm like, great. Looks like VeChain is taking names and kicking ass, whatever you want to call. But uh, I got to tell you, that's not the case. So here it all is in a nutshell. Starbucks, the biggest coffee shop chain in the world, now allows its customers to trace the origins of its coffee using Microsoft's blockchain solution. Let me say it again. Microsoft's blockchain solution. What a bummer. You know, you 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 come into the space and you invest into different projects that you think are going to be good. And what do these, uh, you know, huge conglomerates do? Uh, huge corporations, they just team up together. So now they got Microsoft Blockchain Solution, which uses Azure, I believe. Uh, and that is what is going on. But what's going to what's happening here is that customers will be able to scan codes on the bags of coffee they purchase to discover their origins. So this is kind of a bummer, but you got to understand, uh, these big corporations, they're going to get in where they fit in. Um, and what's going to happen is that, you know, they're going to say, hey, we can offer blockchain, we can offer blockchain. But here's the thing. They are, all these huge corporations, uh, they are not very nimble. They have to, they have multiple layers of management. They have to go through a lot of hoops and uh, just to get, in just to land one account. So these types of things, I'm like, okay, well, that sucks. I kind of hoping that they would go another route. But of course, unfortunately, they went for Microsoft. But I truly believe if you just look at history and business, I mean, just take a look at, Blockbuster. They tried to pivot on a dime when they found out that people were streaming services. And actually, Netflix came to them and said, hey, you want to buy us? And like, no, we don't want that because we're Blockbuster and we're awesome and we'll always crush you. And uh, we know what happened there. But uh, when you're new and you're young and you can kind of do these things because you don't have uh, these, these huge layers of management, you can get out there and you can really change the world. Uh, so I don't see this as uh, being a pop-off for every type of thing. I think Microsoft, I think IBM, they will get in for these different Different places but I do not see them be the majority because they are just so darn big and they can't be like the smaller different types of blockchain products that are out there the ones that you and I invest in so that's what we have let's move on